The Grantham Lions Park in St. Catharines played host to the 16th annual Hike for Hospice Niagara. It's an opportunity for our community to get together and to celebrate compassionate care and also to have a moment of celebration for the, our loved ones and our friends that we have lost. This year, the Hike for Hospice hopes to raise $123,000. All of the money that we raise helps Hospice Niagara to deliver all of our services and programs throughout the Niagara region. We have the 10-bed Stabler Centre, which is a residential hospice, but many people don't know that we have services that are available in their own homes. So we have volunteers that are highly skilled and trained to help people in their journey, whether that's an end-of-life journey or it's help to living with um, a life-limiting illness. We have teams that, um, with our partners, provide a palliative care physician, as well as nurses and counselors, again, in people's homes, so that palliative care is never far away from, from the family that needs us. And we also have a lot of bereavement services. So in any given year, we would run 200 bereavement groups from all ages, five years old, all the way up to adults, to help people who are grieving. This year's walk saw over 400 people come out in support of Hospice Niagara. We are walking for my dad. My dad was in the hospice last year for four days, and we are walking for him in his memory. We've got my mom and my brother Mike and my brother Rob and both of their families and also my daughter Emily. We all came out because we wanted to support my, the memory of my dad. When we were at hospice, it, it felt like we were at home. It felt like the nurses were there to help us out and they took a stress off. We didn't even have to think about what we were going to do, what we were going to eat. We just were there for my dad. Last year alone saw more than 17,000 people benefit from Hospice Niagara's programs and services. Today I'm a hiker. I also work at Hospice Niagara with uh, patients and families at end of life and those who are grieving their deaths. So today's an important day because we're celebrating life, but we're also wanting to remember our friends and loved ones that are no longer with us, and we're honoring their memory in this walk today. Our community has always embraced Hospice Niagara, and for people that are um, wondering how they can continue to help, just give us a call, because every day somebody needs your support. For more information on programs and services provided by Hospice Niagara, visit hospiceniagara.ca. In St. Catharines, you're watching The Source.